What is up guys, Chu here, bringing you another actual live reaction slash review on Shogoki no Soma, the chapter just dropped minutes ago, and at the time of this recording. And I'm honestly super excited because of last week, we know that Mana tasted the food and it was delicious, she was mind blown by it, and honestly, it seems as this is going to be Soma's victory, a lot of us are already speculating and guaranteeing it almost. I do apologize for my dogs barking. But I do also want to say that I think that Asahi is going to be angry about this. I don't think he's going to take this lightly. I think he's going to try to fight it. Uh, but we'll see. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into it. So, bam! Alright. The first bite and the second bite, it pulls you in. This man pushes onward into the storm. Kind of like that reference that we've seen with Juichiro, and now we're seeing it with him, and we saw it with Asahi, okay? And the one who caused it, yeah, there's that little manga stream thing, is his own personal magic. He cast a spell on me. This might be the uh, thumbnail. This picture of uh, Demon, Demon uh, King uh, Soma and uh, Mana, I just think. But you guys remember last last week's chapter, we had her doing the ordinary strip. So now it looks like we're gonna see more about that. Oh, it's not an ordinary stripping. What do you mean by that, Father? This phenomenon. Even for me, this is the first time. So you're telling me that Mana and you never got crazy in love and just like ripped each other's clothes like that? You know, I'm I'm just you know, just saying here. But, um, apparently the audience is, uh, are going crazy. We're seeing Nikumi, we're seeing all the other characters just kind of losing their clothes. It's bursting and they're stripping. So, it's, it's, it is a phenomenon because both are happening. So, that's cool in its own way, I guess. <laughs> it's funny to see how, like, some of the guys from the, uh, Polar House dormitory are all kind of like, you know, ah, you know, what the heck? And Alice is like, so it looks like Aunt Mana has finally felt its deliciousness. Uh, and then we have Asahi here. This is what I was trying to get to. Like, Asahi seeing, like, how he's going to react to all this. How could such a thing happen? How can there be a chef in this world who can cross the, the that can rival the cross knives on their own? I hate this mentality of his. How could they have had made so how could they have made something even more delicious than my basuti? Even if Yokohita Soma's dish hadn't been so delicious, the problem wouldn't lie there. Indeed, your basuti was a masterpiece that expertly wove in all the flavors. But once you eliminate the mask, beyond that, it's empty. Okay, so basically what I'm getting from here is it on the surface it looks it the the dish is a lot like Asahi. It makes sense now. Because the dish had, was very good uh, and it looked good. But once you take away the layers of it, you see that there's not much else to offer. And that's kind of how Asahi is. Like he on the surface is a good is a good chef. He has these extraordinary abilities. But there's nothing really making him standing out. Like nothing really makes him like above and beyond. So it's like... It makes sense to me, like, why his dish didn't excel. And Mana's explaining this to him. Don't you realize it, too, once you search your own heart? In order to, to look away from having to see the truth beyond your lack of self on this plate, you continue to strip other chefs of their knives. On the other hand, Yukihira Soma, after facing and cultivating it from everyone he's met, he has placed upon his plate his own personal flavor. So, uh, adding on more to the explanation, we have him kind of realize or being told that he took things away from people. Uh, and he just continued this way. He didn't really learn. All he did was basically just steal people's abilities or weapons or whatever. While Soma, on the other hand, did go up against people and didn't take anything from him other than the fact that they could help him improve, which, honestly, that makes the most sense. Uh, at that that difference through his five rice was truly conveyed. Now then, 
unhinging, uh, un, I, th I think it says unging, unging is at hand, I, I don't even know what that means. Please decide. But my dad, okay, hold on. Please decide. It is how you said. You said it yourself that you're, you, that you're the man that completely surpassed reaching him. But my dad, whom I've been chasing since I was a brat, is far, far stronger. And I like the look that Soma's giving. He's like giving this look of like anger. So could it have been that maybe Juicho threw that match like he didn't actually want to win it? Because that's a possibility now that I think about it. And that was about 30 chapters ago, or at least something like that, where he lost. And, you know, it could be that that is the case. So uh, it makes sense to me. And he even says, you know, oh, you're, that my dad is stronger. So it makes sense. Like, we all, when we all saw that battle, we all were speculating, like, how is this possible? Is this dude really that strong? And he is. But Juichiro probably wasn't going at full force. That's just the honest truth. So now all the judges are deciding. The winner is Soma. Soma is the winner. 3 nothing. So that's awesome. <sighs> Yukihira Soma. Everyone's in shock. Soma-kun, Yukihira, you really are quite the guy. With this, he finally got into the final of blues. And that's funny because we have Nikomi and the girls just holding each other still in their bras. So awesome. Awesome sauce. But now we're seeing everyone, all the the, the night chefs are just kind of like, uh, you know, couldn't, can't believe this. It's, it's funny. The results are the results. You're the winner. Uh, Yukihira, take this and give it back to Drishino. What's this? <laughs> He's giving him his dad's knife. I, I don't know. From when he started cooking and was a, and was adopted into your household, this is the knife he always used. When I challenged him with Saiba's knife, I took it from him. Uh huh. In other words, it's Yukihira's knife. <laughs> For me, who couldn't take the seat of the strongest in blue. It's an it's an inappropriate knife to keep. I don't need it. You beat my dad and won it fair and square, didn't you? In that case, you should just keep it confidently or something. More importantly, asahi -kun, why did you want to make Nakati your bride? Ooh, okay. Now, now, now we're getting into the juicy stuff because now, now it's making a lot of sense to me. Like this is what I was trying to get to. Like, we know that he wanted to be the best. He wanted to impress Mana. But what is it that he wanted out of Irina? And he has a face of shock. Don't tell me they have some kind of past here where they may have met. Because that would suck. I would hate that. And it would make absolutely no sense because where they were. Irina was in Japan. He was in a different side of the world. That didn't make sense. <sighs> All right. When I dropped out of Totsuki school and wandered all over the school, all over the world, excuse me, my passion for cooking had been a bit extinguished. And I hear it's a flashback. It's a flashback here. At that time was when I met my wife. Oh, God. She was such a weird woman. And we met her, uh, Tamako. She is a little bit weird. She's terrible at cooking, but she's always standing in the kitchen waiting to cook. If you saw her, she'd always be worried, mumbling to her to herself like a fool. <sighs> I was without a doubt saved by her, so now I'm trying to give back whatever little I can. You know that that's normally how that works, but I think she'll definitely feel the same way. I mean, whenever you talk about her, Drichido, you seem super happy, so I'm sure she's really happy right now too. And she's like, I guess so. Okay, okay. All right, Asahi, how about I teach you something good? The trick to becoming a good chef. Okay, okay. So if you can find someone who makes you want to give all your cooking to them. Ah, it's obvious, right? So that I can get stronger. Is that right? I could have sworn that what you wanted was completely different. What are you talking about? Okay. Did I want to become stronger? Now he's having doubts. Or maybe maybe he didn't necessarily want to be strong. He wanted to have connections. Maybe he wanted to have bonds with someone. <sighs> what you're searching for, you'll never get without worrying about it. Besides, Sai, as the parent who raised you into a chef, who'd know, who'd know that better than me? Hmm. 
what, what are you saying? My flavor? My own personal flavor? Oh? However, don't underestimate, misunderstand Yokihira Soma. Ah, come on. So now, now, okay. To kind of wrap this up quickly, because it's already a two-minute video. To wrap this up pretty quickly. So we had Soma win. Okay, that's what everyone thought. That's what we were all hoping for. And it makes sense. But, it, it kind of wasn't a really true victory. Because it was like, well, it was for Soma. But for Asahi, we hope that he learns from this. He was basically given the reason that the reason he lost, excuse me, was that he didn't have anything personal. He didn't have anything that was really, like, standing out other than the fact that it was a great dish but that was it that was nothing conveying in it so it makes sense to me at least and so then we have him accepting his defeat at first not really but then after mana's explanation he kind of sees it and he wants to give back the knife and he's like no you know what you can have it you know it's no big deal and like i've already said you know jujitsu could have thrown that match and by the end, we do have this like meeting between the two where it's like, what you're searching for, you know, because he thought maybe being with Irina could have been what saved him. And it was forced because there was no connection. And again, I think that's what he wants. Like we see him kind of like that foreshadowing of Soma's mom, Yuichiro, and Soma as a child. And he didn't have that. So it could be that. Maybe he thought that having Irina as his bride, he could form a connection and save himself and maybe become a better chef and have a personal flavor like, like Soma has. But by the end of the chapter, after everyone's kind of celebrating with him and they have clothes again, which, which is weird, uh, we have Mana actually saying, don't misunderstand Soma. So it's like, what does this mean? Like, we know that she, he's going to have to be facing Irina at the end. But what, what's going on, you know? Like, that's, it's a win. That's what I was saying. It was a win, but not really because he hasn't won it all. There's something else. There's like a catch-22 there that just doesn't seem right. But guys, that is it for me. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Please like the video. Comment down below your thoughts. Um, I will do, I do want to say something real quick. Um, I do plan on making this week a video on, uh, Shogugeki season four there hasn't been anything out yet i just want you guys to know that there hasn't been any news however i do want to talk about it because there was something that came up a little while ago and i hadn't actually talked about it and i feel like this would be a good time to talk about you know where the manga is right now i think it would be the perfect time for the anime to kind of start up soon there, like i said there hasn't been any confirmation any news on any of that stuff however like i said it seems as though there's some factors that may be affecting why there hasn't been one yet just say but that's in a different video guys as always though stay safe take care of yourselves leave me let me know what you guys think in the comment section below what did you guys think about you know this chapter what do you think is going to be happening now with adina versus soma and what is going to be happening with asahi do you guys have any any predictions will we see asahi again because uh, we thought we weren't going to see Sukasa, We didn't think we were going to see Azami. And we see him again. Kind of like reformed good guys. Could the same be said about the Noirs. And him. You know. It's a possibility. Maybe the gen maybe General and, and Asahi get together. And they could have their own personal flavor that way. You know. It's a possibility. But guys. That is it for me. Again. I'm sorry for making this video a little too long. As always. Stay safe. Take care of yourselves. Appreciate it. Uh, that bunny from Oran, and I'll catch you later.